Cryptocurrencies were trading flat to positive on Tuesday as traders await the outcome of the FOMC meet scheduled November 2nd, where there are expectations of another 75 basis points rate hike, which is already discounted by the market participants. So investors will be closely watching Fed's stance whether hawkish or less hawkish, which will determine further trends in the markets. If Fed hikes interest rate by 75 basis points, it would be the fourth consecutive 75 basis rate hike, which is which the market has actually observed. The US unemployment rate for the October is also set to be released on November 4th, so keep an eye on these two important data points. IC15 index of cryptocurrency were trading down by 1.4% at 31,180 points. If you talk about the global cryptocurrency market cap that topped the $1 trillion mark during the early hours after trading flat in the last 24 hours. However, the total trading volume soared more than 21% at $86 billion. The central bank is widely anticipated to increase interest rate by 75 basis. That's what we have highlighted in its Wednesday, Wednesday's rate setting meeting. So, at the conclusion of its two-day policy meet, but investors will be on the lookout for any signs that the Fed might consider or either slowing down the interest rate increase in the future uh, rate setting meeting as well. So as investors attention shift to this week's policy meet of the Federal Reserve's US equity lost ground with major indices closing as strong, uh, I mean a strong month of gains on a weaker note. The Dow Jones Industrial Average dropped by 0.4% and S&P 500 lost 29 points or 0.75% and the Nasdaq Composite dropped 114 points or it lost 1.03%. If we talk about Bitcoin, the largest cryptocurrency was, was at $20,550 down 1.1%. If we talk about Ethereum, the second largest crypto was down by 2.2% at $1,590. On my left, the other altcoins we've talked about, Binance BNB was down 1.3%, was trading at $324. Solana Sol was down by 4%, was trading at $33. Next on the list was Avalanche FX was at $19, down by 1.6%. Polkadot was down by 2.8% at $6. Polygon Matic was down by 3.5% to trade at $0.89. Cardano's ADA token was down by 1.5% to trade at $0.40. Ripple's XRP token was at $0.46, down 0.1%. Doge, the popular meme coin, was trading up by 15.5% at $0.14. So, the most popular meme coin Doge has had a great week in the crypto market, enjoying a spectacular rally of nearly 170%. Doge has been on the tier since Musk takeover of the Twitter. It is also widely expected that the Musk will introduce a payment system on Twitter that will involve Doge and the crypto market is routing for it. That's what the market analyst and market news is all about. Next on the list was Shiba Inu was trading up by 3%. The Shiba Inu community is preparing for a massive upside as the Shiba Inu team plans to introduce several features including the Shibarium update. As a result, the meme, uh, meme token Shiba price has soared by over 6% in the last 24 hours and within a week it has jumped 30%. So if you talk about the technical, technical analysis of the entire cryptocurrency market, Bitcoin price started a downward correction after it failed to surpass $21,000 resistance zone. So Bitcoin actually corrected below $20,600 and $20,500 levels. The decline gained pace below $20,500 level and the 100 hourly simple moving average. However, the bulls were active near $20,250 levels. A low was formed near $20,250, which is the same price, and the price started a steady upward move. There was a wave about to $20,400 and $20,500 levels. So keep an eye on these two important numbers. The first major resistance sits near 20,700 level. If Bitcoin fails to clear above $20,700 resistance zone, it could start another downward move. An immediate support on the downside is near $20,400 zone. If you talk about Ethereum and the technical parameters has started a downward correction after it formed a short term top near $1,665 level mark. Ethereum declined below $1,620 and $1,600 levels. So Ethereum price even spiked below. I mean, it, it fell below $1,580 level and the 100 hourly simple moving average. 
However, the bulls who are active near $1,550 support zone and immediate resistance on the upside is near $1,620 level while the first major resistance is near $1,640 and $1,650 level. So keep an eye on these important numbers above which the price could gain bullish momentum. If Ethereum fails to climb above $1,625, it could continue to move down and initial support on the downside is near $1,575 level and the 100 hourly simple moving average. So that's all there is in today's coin monitor. This is Manoj Dara signing off, but keep watching 3.0 TV for more such interesting updates. Thank you.